The Target 12 investigators take you inside the mafia now. Former mob captain Robert DeLuca has been spared prison time despite admitting his role in an infamous Federal Hill murder nearly three decades ago. Prosecutors supported the sentence because they say DeLuca was key in convicting a former mob boss. Target 12 investigator Tim White has been tracking the case for years and is here now with the exclusive details. Robert DeLuca is serving time in an undisclosed federal prison because of his cooperation against the mob, and now he's asking a judge to release him early during this pandemic. This is file video of former mob capo Robert Bobby DeLuca from 2017 when he pleaded no contest to murder conspiracy for the 1992 Federal Hill slaying of mob enforcer Kevin Hanrahan. The actual gunman has never been caught, but DeLuca admitted to taking part in the planning that ended with Hanrahan being shot three times in the head. Last Monday, the 75-year-old was quietly sentenced in the Hanrahan case. DeLuca was given a 10-year sentence, but Judge Brian Stern suspended the majority of it and DeLuca was given credit for time served dating back to his June 2016 arrest, meaning when his federal sentence is done, DeLuca won't have to go back to prison. In 2018, DeLuca testified against former mob boss Francis Cadillac Frank Salemi, who was convicted for ordering the murder of Boston nightclub manager Stephen DeSaro. DeSaro's body was exhumed from behind the Providence Mill building in 2016. Salemi, now 87 years old, was sentenced to life behind bars. DeLuca was sentenced to five years for initially lying to federal investigators about what he knew of DeSaro's murder. In 2018, DeLuca sent a letter to a federal judge saying he denounced the mob and said he found God. DeLuca's federal prison sentence will end in December 2021, but he could get out earlier if a judge approves his compassionate release request. With the Target 12 investigators, Tim White, 12 News.